Welcome to Studio Lighting Techniques in Maxwell Render. My name is James Coleman and I'm the Maxwell Render Mentor at the University of Brighton Centre for Design Technology. Welcome back to part 5. In this video I'll explain how to finally control the amount of light a reflector reflects back into the scene. Here's my current setup at the moment. My left plane is an emitter, my top plane is an emitter and my right plane is a reflector. And if I go to my close-up you can see the effect that my right reflector is having. If I turn it off the right hand side of the scene darkens slightly. But what if when I turn it back on again, the right hand side is now too light and I'd like it to be darker? Well there is a simple way to change this. I'm going to go back to my overview so I can see what I'm doing. And then I'm going to select my diffuse material and right click and clone the material. And now in the new diffuse material, which is automatically named diffuse underscore one, I'm going to change the reflectance zero and change the mode to HSV and then in my value, I'm going to type 128 and then enter. And then refresh my preview with this icon. And so now I've got a grey material. It's still diffuse, but it's now grey. So close out the material editor, and then select it, return, rename it to diffuse grey. And then click and drag it onto the right reflector. And so now I have a reflector which isn't reflecting as much light as it would if it was white but it's still reflecting more light than if it wasn't there at all. If I make it visible again and go to my close-up view, what I can do is open my diffuse grey and then interactively change the colour of the reflectance zero value. If I change it all the way down to black, the right-hand side of the scene darkens. If I put it up again to white as it was before, the right-hand scene lightens slightly. This is a way of fine-tuning your lighting environment so that you get the exact lighting that you want. Thanks very much for watching and in the next video I'll look at the effect of using a coloured reflector. For more information about support, consultation and mentoring in CAD and Maxwell Render at the University of Brighton Centre for Design Technology, email maxwellrenderbrightoncdt at gmail.com.